wonder how these snakes feel about being tortured in one small container. Ow! And this snake has not struck yet, so good job, no Sage. Friends and family, welcome back to the channel. I've got my sidekick today, my main man, Mr. Noah Sage, co-hosting with me. He hasn't been here for a hot minute. No, main I... man. Main man. Main man. You're my first boy. I don't see how that makes me the main man. You're just as bad at me as accepting a compliment, so it's genetic. Uh, we've got a clutch here for you today, clutch number 2304. I know I'm doing these titles and people are confused about 2304. That ain't yet, bro. It's 2023 is the 23, and then it's clutch number four of 2023, and I just reverse them because that's how I've always done it. 2304, fourth clutch of 2023. If you're coming over from Morph Market, all the chapters are down below, even though these might not be on Morph Market as you're watching this video yet. If you're coming over, just subscribe from the channel. There's actually the clutch before we still haven't uploaded yet, but we've got a beautiful clutch we're gonna share with you today, and we're going to do that in just a second here, right after I give you a personal update. And that personal update is, where are you going, Noah Sage? That, that personal update is, well, it was very, very difficult for me to get from the bed to the bathroom this morning because I've, for the second time, they should have thrown my lower back out. And so I'm on a very interesting mix of painkillers and coffee right now. So I almost cried trying to put my pants on one leg at a time this morning, but you know, that's what it is. I'm supposed to host and play in a pickleball tournament tomorrow. Definitely gonna host, probably not gonna play, but that's my own personal update. and. Should we just get into the snakes? Am I boring people, do you think? I, I think I'd be pretty bored right now. All right, fair enough. Let's get into the snakes then. This clutch was from a pairing, a beautiful pairing. One Enchi Red Stripe Spot Nose Clown produced by Canova, paired with a Cinnamon Lesser Het Clown Female produced by my buddy, Mr. Chase Baker. The male's name is uh, Scuba Steve and the female is Rolanda. So, Let's take a look at the babies that came out and we'll go one at a time. And again, chapter markers down below if you wanna skip ahead to one particular baby if you're coming over from Morph Market. But the very first snake that we're going to show here today is a male and he is a spot nose. And he is 100% het clown as all the non-visual clowns here are in this clutch for obvious reasons if you know your genetics. Spot nose clown looks a little extra Every time I get like new snakes and they hatch out, I'm always like trying to impart more genetics into them with my mind as I look at them. But I, as I spent some time and came back to reality after the happiness of a clutch, this guy was obviously just spot nose, but also enhanced by the Het Clown, which Het Clown does a great job of enhancing colors and brightening up a snake um, in many cases. And that's just another reason to love Clown is that even if it's not a visual clown, you got a visual clown in the pairing, all of your non-visual clowns are extra beautiful, in my professional opinion. What do you think, Noah Sage? What? <laughs> I was admiring the snake. Oh, well, it's a good reason to be distracted. Should we move on to snake number two? Yes. Did that <laughs> snake just try to bite you? No. So this second snake here is a red stripe, also a male. We were a little heavy male on this clutch versus females, but that's okay. Uh, we do like to see a lot of females, especially with clown clutches, because I don't, I don't know. Well, any clutch, I guess we like a lot of females, but this one is a male, red stripe, beautiful looking red stripe. Um, you know, these snakes, if you compare them to a normal, it's obvious, because I think to the untrained eye, this looks just, could just look a lot like a normal. Shall we get out a normal so you can see the difference? Sure. So now we've got these two side by side, you can see some obvious color differences. The red stripe is a bit lighter, has a, a lot more back striping going on, and just lighter pattern on the back, just lighter pattern altogether. And one of the big things to look at is the amount of graveling inside the alien heads on the sides versus the lack of anywhere near as much graveling on the sides of this normal ball python, wild type ball python. So, you see the difference, Noah's age? Yeah, I see the difference. Yep. Yeah. Also a huge difference in pattern. So this third snake here is an Enchi Red Stripe Spot Nose. Male, and he's looking pretty good. You know, the Enchi, you've got that banding going across. The spot nose, you got the extra contrast and wild head stamp, and then the, the red stripe is just kind of a, like a coloration thing. There's a lot more red showing up in the 
darker part of the pattern, the blushing coming through there on like the neck stripes and, and just all the black part of the pattern that's coming across the back. You got the extra red coming in and then a little bit of the head stamp kind of says red stripe, but that's very minimal, but just a little, little different change in the color of this snake and, and some of the alien heads on the sides uh, are the red stripes showing through. But the Enchi and the spot nose to me are obvious. I wonder how these snakes feel about being tortured in one small container. Well, we're not we're not torturing them. They're they're just hanging out together. Um, we're, the idea is not to torture them. It's uh, just to keep them in one place so we can easily pull them out. If the I was the size of that snake, one of those snakes, and Eli and Leia were in there with me, then I would probably consider it torture. Yep. Well, that's the difference between humans and snakes, because snakes really like a little tight, compact spot. And when these guys all first hatched out, they actually all hid together in their mom's coils, and that's so a snake is nothing like a human in that regard. Um, I mean, they'll probably enjoy their own space when they are done with this video, but yeah, it, <laughs> I, I hear what you're saying. They're not humans, though. Yeah, they're, they're definitely not humans. They do look different, but a lot of them look pretty similar. Yeah, I'll do look at it. We'll, we'll, take, we'll pile them all down here as soon as we're done, and you can pick one, which one you think is your favorite, okay? So this one is the red stripe we were looking at earlier, and snake number four here is a red stripe lesser. Interesting thing to me here is that lesser is a very powerful gene and red stripe seems to complement it very well um, because it's not overpowering the red stripe. In fact, the, the red stripe and the lesser seem to be blending together very well here. And I think there might be spot nose. The, the head stamp is not screaming that, but there's this extra contrast happening along the dorsal pattern. And even along the alien has that extra black showing in it. It's making me think that it might be spot nose. I'm not going to list this as spot nose. I'm just gonna put that that's possibly spot nose going on here. And if it, if it happens to be, that's gonna be an extra bonus for you if you get this snake. Uh, the extra bonus about this snake too is this is the first female of the clutch so far. So lesser red stripe, uh, possible spot nose, female. Wait, wait, Dad. Clown. What's how, up? Like, why are you going in like this partic particular order? Like, so I, I'm starting age with, order. Oh uh, no, I'm going with the least amount of genetics versus um, the one that got the most amount of genetics from their parents. That's the order I'm going in. Mm. Whoa, 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 whoa! See, they're, torture. I'm not torturing them. They're just, they're just, they're just a little skittish because they're babies still, and they're, yes, they are. Just very fast. They're fast. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, dude. Don't worry, we're all gonna have our own separate spaces in just a moment here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This guy really wants to be in his own separate space right now. So this here, you wanna hold him? Ow! <laughs> You're very mean. That wasn't mean, he just got scared. She, uh, yes, he, she, she just got a little scared. Another, oh, there's a little blood. Yeah, a little blood, tiny teeth bring a little blood. It's, uh, it happens sometimes, but you're good. So cinnamon lesser clown this is our first visual clown of the clutch uh -oh. and the cinnamon color with the lesser pattern comboed with clown you know maybe there's some red stripe in here but i'm not gonna i'm not even gonna put possible red stripe if it there happens to be then lucky you it's also a female so cinnamon lesser clown gorgeous looking animal clown is just ah, just love clown i love clown this cut stings this snake is an enchi red stripe clown i'm gonna say possible spot nose because the amount of well, there's there's a bit more extra contrast that I'm seeing around the side. I'm not going to sell it as a spot nose. I'm just going to say that it's possible that there's spot nose here, but there is definitely Enchi, there is definitely Clown, and there is definitely Red Stripe. The Red Stripe, I can see all of the red blushing coming through the dorsal stripe, as well as that head pattern and the kind of little like headphone ears or the kind of ears up on the top of the, the head pattern here on the sides, like kind of like headphones trying to come down. And this snake has not struck yet, so good job, no Sage. <laughs> what the heck, dude? <laughs> was it did it hurt more or was it was it more more painful or surprising? Painful. It was more painful than it was surprising? Like it it doesn't sting as much afterward, but like as soon as it bit me it felt more painful like but then for some reason this one stings more later afterward this one feels pretty fine already do we need to go to the hospital <laughs> well i was gonna say i like th the way this one looked the best but behavior wise uh, this one looks real nice this is snake number seven and this is a male and whoa oh, he dad just, sorry he just kind of jumped backwards out of my hand and i think I know, I can say for with certainty, this is definitely an Enchi, definitely Clown, 
definitely spot nose, and I say definitely red stripe and definitely lesser actually. So let's just go ahead and call this an Enchi lesser red stripe spot nose clown male that I'm keeping. So it doesn't matter if I'm correct on the genetics or not, because he's not going on the market. I'm going to keep him and put him to some females here next year. So he does look really, uh, really cool. Pretty cool, huh? Well, why don't we go ahead and uh, I'd like you to go ahead and choose which one you think is your favorite based on looks alone. Not attitude, just looks. <laughs> Mm, either this one or this one. One of the last two? Yeah. Uh... These are the two that happen to get the most amount of uh, genetic uh, morphology from their parents. So I would say that you have good taste, also expensive taste. So that must be genetic too. <laughs> <laughs> I've been giving everybody an update on uh, your little baby brother every after every one of these snake videos. Should we go do that? Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's toasty out here and bright. And I need to clean that garage up, but oh, going up the stairs is fun. Going up the stairs is a blast. Oh, yeah, all right, bright eyes. Coming for you, bright eyes. Oh, all right. Okay. Hello, bright eyes. How are you doing down there, my guy? Are you doing nice? Are you having a good day? Oh, you little smiley guy. You got something to say? You got something to say, brothers? Tell us a story. We want to hear a story, brothers. What you got to say about it, brothers? <laughs> oh, you little. Well, he's just over three months old today, and oh, I don't think I'm gonna be getting up from here for a little while. Oh, he's been talking up a storm, but apparently he's got nothing to say right now. Nothing to say, brothers. Nothing to say at all. He plays, he learned to play piano today. Well, and piano with the baby toy. Piano with the baby toy, but piano nonetheless. Hello, my hey, you little brothers. You're a nice guy. Yeah, I'm gonna lay down here for a while. <laughs> you guys take care of yourselves, take care of each other, and we'll see you on the next video. Aloha. No stories today, huh, beds? Are you gonna get him <laughs> I see those pitties again. I'm gonna get those pitties. <laughs> <laughs>